Hello everybody, it's Miss Ashworth here, the Year 2 class teacher. I hope you're all doing well and I really hope that the children have enjoyed coming back to school and enjoyed their time in Year 2 so far. So in Year 2, there's myself, Miss Ashworth and Mrs Singleton, who is a Year 2 teaching assistant and welfare staff. So I'm just going to cover a few different things that usually I would talk you through on our Meet the Teacher evening. But obviously, due to the current circumstances, this is how we're going to cover everything that we would usually go through. So throughout the course of the year, the children in class will receive some different homework tasks to have a go at on different websites such as Phonics Play, Class Dojo, Purple Mash and Times Table Rockstars. Now at the minute, um, the children have just got spellings as their homework and home reading books. So spellings are sent on Friday and the class will receive a set of spellings for the week to practice for the week ahead. So at the minute, we just have spelling and reading for homework. However, as we move throughout the course of the year, we might add some activities on phonics play or purple mash, etc. Reading books will be changed on Mondays in class. Please encourage your child to read little and often. Ideally, what we're looking for is three times a week. However, I am very mindful and aware that lots of children have different activities and clubs going on out of school, so that can't always be possible. But ideally three times a week and the children will receive two books that they will have for the week and reading books again changed on Mondays. Our PE days in year two are Monday and Thursday. On those days, children need to come to school in their PE kit on PE days. They can wear a black or navy tracksuit bottoms or leggings and trainers may be worn with house coloured t-shirts and school sweatshirts. Each week I will be sharing with you photos on Class Dojo showing what the children have been learning and what they've been getting up to in class that week. And if you have any issues, questions or queries, anything at all, please do not hesitate to contact me via Class Dojo message between the hours of 8am and 6pm Mondays to Fridays or phone the office. And I'll always aim to message back as promptly as possible to try and deal with any concerns or issues straight away in class. In year two we cover a wide variety of topics. I think there's a topic there for everybody to enjoy. We have Beside the Seaside, The Wind and the Willows, MasterChef where we will be creating our own fruit kebabs and explorers learning all about Neil Armstrong and a story called The Disappearing Moon. Our topic at the minute in class is turrets and towers. So in history, the class are learning all about kings and queens and monarchs. And we'll, we, we will be feeding this topic into our artwork with observational art. And during English, we are creating our own adventure story. So lots of exciting things for the children to be looking forward to this year in year two. Welcome back to St Barnabas Church of England Primary Academy. I'm Mrs Ham, the head teacher, and on behalf of all of our staff, I'd like to welcome you all back into our school family for a new and exciting school year. We've all had to learn to do things differently over the last couple of weeks and months, such as social distancing, increased hand washing, staggered starts and finishes, and staggered breaks and lunch times. We've also had to get used to class bubbles in school, but the children have really taken it all in their stride and it's been amazing to see their huge Mother Teresa smiles. Our Christian values are at the heart of everything we do at St Barnabas. They are forgiveness, friendship, generosity, trust, respect, service and courage. St Barnabas was known in the Bible as an encourager, so we work hard to encourage each other to persevere and try our best. We manage our behaviour through our Christian values and ask our children to reflect on whether they've demonstrated our Christian values. In weekly family worship, we learn which values each class has been focusing on and how they've demonstrated that value. We continuously reflect on how we can show our Christian values in and out of our school and in our community and the wider world. Whilst your child's on their journey through our school, you can expect us to work hard to ensure that they have the best possible education whilst also having a lot of fun. 
We expect you to support our school to educate your child. Please make sure you arrive at school on time and be mindful of parking. Outside of our school, we don't have a great deal of parking. So we do encourage our parents to park further away and then walk uh, in, up to the schoolyard. Please ensure your child attends school regularly. Attendance is so important and every school day counts. Please ensure your child is smart and proud of their appearance, that they're wearing the correct school uniform and they're not wearing earrings and jewellery. Please help them to be ready to learn by getting lots of sleep at home, making sure that they go to bed early and they're ready in the morning, refreshed and they've come to school having already had their breakfast and ready to learn. Please support them with any tasks to be completed at home, their homework and home reading. If you could let us know of any changes in your contact details or any home circumstances, please let us know and let our school office know. If your child is going to be absent for any reason, please let us know at school. We have a duty of care towards your children and we need to investigate if they're not in school. So please let us know. If not, we will be contacting you and we'll be trying to find out why they're not in school. If you have any issues or concerns, please speak to us. I'm on the schoolyard most mornings and after school. If you've got any issues, any worries, any concern, please contact us. There are so many ways that you can keep in touch with us and we really do pride ourselves on our effective communication with our parents. If you've got any issue at all, like I've just said, please don't sit on the issue, just contact us and it can easily be resolved. You may phone the school office at any time or contact us via email. However, our class teachers will only be available to speak to you after school as they'll be setting up lessons in the morning and teaching throughout the day. The most effective way to contact class teachers directly though is through class storage or messages. And like I've said, I'll be on the schoolyard each morning and after school, so please feel free to speak to me or any other staff member about any concerns or questions. We'll keep you informed of any upcoming events through Class Dojo, Twitter and our Friends of St Barnabas Facebook page. We'll also let you know what your child has been learning each week by showing photographs from the week on our class stories on Class Dojo. Any payments to be made are made via parent pay as we are a cashless school. All infants are entitled to a universal free school meal so there'll be no lunch payments required for the first three years of your child's education. Thank you so much for your continued support and being so patient with us with our staggered starts and finishes. It's been an absolute delight to have all the children back into school again and you can hear a real buzz around school which is fantastic. We can't wait for the rest of the year. Thank you very much and again if you have any questions or queries please do not hesitate to contact us via Class Dojo or the school office. Thank you.